Hi there people, this is Tappy08 and this is a little bit of a walkthrough on how to get through the second raid on Destiny Crow's End. Here's a list of the people uh, that I completed it with tonight. Uh, and here we go. Basically you want to get on this side of uh, the shard or whatever it is. And as soon as uh, the whole field goes down, I really want to go ham on all the enemies just on one side. Uh, grenades, you uh, basically just to kill everybody. Forget about the other side. I mean, you save about a minute to get about the other side. So here we go. You'll see how fast we get through the side. Any grenades over there, blast them like a fucking. Done and dusted, straight through. And of course, uh, Lawrence is going to stick back here. Well, He's going to snipe the knights that come out on the balcony, which is of course the essential role. The person that's that. going to be holding the sword is going to need that cover. So we're going to get back here. This is a uh, pretty, pretty much a safe zone. We're going to kill the knight, uh, the sword bearer there, and of course uh, the person who's going to get the sword for the, the TMB07 is going to collect it. He's a level 31, which is pretty much essential. Uh, we've got uh, weapons of light there as well. We've got two titans on this, uh, using weapons of light. I, I'm one of them. Uh, I've got another one that's uh, using the weapons of light, which of course is going to get uh, quota down okay. uh, a lot quicker than other enemies, as you'll see. So the sword there, the TMB is up there. Uh, the fuck is not down? He, he just regained his life. Oh. You're going to need a few telemetries for this as well. Uh, I mean, uh, you're definitely going to need uh, a heavy weapon telemetry. I mean, I must have used about 20 or 30 just to get through this bit altogether. I mean, this is, this is probably my. Uh, when you've tried, 30 you've tried or something like that to do this. But this seems to be the best method. As you can see now you've got uh, Jay Baker up there, he's creating plenty of orbs. That was a stupid thing by me. Don't stick your head out. You've got Jay Baker up there uh, creating plenty of orbs for the uh, Tom who's gonna go out there, he's gonna put the sword on the he's gonna go out there, he's gonna have a super on the uh, on quota. Got a bubble. You know, bear in mind, it's half four in the morning, I'm quite tired. So here we go, my weapons are lights down. I've made sure that everybody knows my weapons are lights down. Everybody's got it in there. The scarecrow, oh, he's, he's a quick mover as well, he's going to be straight back there. So here we go. Four shots with the rocket launcher, he's down. Have him, have him, have him, have him. Only do that as well when. Uh, the sword bearer, whoever's going up there with the sword, like I say, they need to be level 31 really to do that and to make an effect. Yeah, yeah, get a bit uh, back when there they you tell you to do that, make sure you do that then. So uh, we're killing off any extras that are coming in. After you've, uh, after you've uh, attacked Croak twice, now the ogre's going to come in. So we're going to create another weapons of light. I don't think it's me this time. Just to kill off the ogres there. Like I say, everything's time based, so it needs to be done quickly. There he goes. So we need to get into there. Fire into the ogres. The or whatever they have left on. So you see I'm chaining off him on uh, when he uses his flank. Uh, so I've got mine, he'll get he'll get orbs off mine, so make sure you've got it so if you get if uh, the light's shot, of course uh, it'll create orbs. Hopefully I'm explaining this correctly, you know. I can say it is uh, a bit late here. Yeah. I've got a bubble ready. 
there we go, we've got Jay Baker up there again, he's uh, creating plenty of orbs of light for uh, the TMB, he's going to be going out there, collecting the sword, he's going to have his super to go straight out onto Crota. Cost a little bit of backup, no problem, as long as he's created uh, plenty of orbs for Tom when he goes up there. Don't forget, all this time, you've got uh, Lawrence up in the top corner there, he's... Uh, sniping uh, the knights, creating the cover, because those knights are constantly coming out. Bubbles going down. There we go. I probably put that a little bit too far forward. You need to put it quite closer towards the door, but anyway. Four blasts with rocket launcher. Take him down. Alright, go for it, man. As I say, it needs to be perfect time. You need to... All the time you need to be communicating. You need to be telling everybody what you're doing. And uh, don't find your, your rocket launcher when he's glowing orange. Wait until he, he, he stops glowing orange. You'll see what, he, what I mean when he glows orange. Night, 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 night. As soon as he stops glowing orange, bang, with the rocket launcher. Jesus Christ. I mean, it's, you can anticipate it as well. He did, no didn't he? He bounced all the way over there. <laughs> Sphinx is sweet. <laughs> I've got buckets, man, I'm ready for it. I've not got any bubble though. Get your bubble ready. Here we go, we're all going to have one as well. Get him down as fast as possible. Got Jay Baker up there creating plenty of orbs again. Weapons are light, everybody ploughs into that. He's down, no need for him. Four or five shots, definitely, that's all you need on him. And do not stay on him too long. I know you might feel a little bit greedy, you might feel like, ah, oh, I need to. It's him one more time. Don't. Just get enough on him. Back off. Right, you see his glowing orange there. One more go, he's down. Anyway, now we know the ogres are coming again. So we're backing off. Right, I've got a bubble. I've got the weapons of light, waiting for the ogres to come, making sure they're in our sight. And of course, Lawrence has come down from upstairs sniping. He doesn't need to be up there while this is going on. He needs to be down here. Getting ready with the weapons of light, there we go. Straight down, everybody plows into it, weapons of light. How many of you? Oh my god, I'm gonna run out of bullets. bullets. Probably the first time I've used a, a normal ammo synth, <laughs> just by chance they had it on me. Yeah, make sure we uh, if you're running low on energy, make sure you let the person know you're running low on energy. Of course, Tom usually has a chalice as well because uh, he's going to be going out facing go for it, go for it, go for it, go for it. facing Crota. So he needs that to regen his health while he's up there. And while you're in eight, it's very rare that it you'll get hit as well. There we go, Jay Baker's uh, created a load of orbs again. Uh, mentioned Bionicle and Big Boss as well, they were of course an essential role in this. The guys actually did this last night and I've uh, joined in tonight and done this, so they've done this twice. A few of the guys have done this twice. Oh, I think they're actually doing it now as well. I can see that heavy weapon out there as well. Right. There's another one there, but don't risk it. Fit back in. To tell you the truth, I've probably Spent 20 grand, 20,000 glimmer on, uh, on this shit. Anyway, this is the last one. 
fits in down. Times it just right. Bang, bang, bang. Job's good. Yeah, get in, boys. Get in. Gee, now, doesn't it look simple? <laughs> <laughs> well played, lads. Well played, lads. The end.